I liked last week's kit so much I'm using another one this week. Hi everybody, today I'm planning out the week of September 3rd through Sunday the 9th, 2018 in my Erin Condren Horizontal Neutral Planner. And can you believe it is September? This year is, is blowing by. School's in, shit's going on, all the things. Hell yeah. So last week I used a kit from Gabriella Elena Designs that I ordered during the big collab sale and I really liked how it worked and I have another one that I had gotten from her so I'm just going to do two in a row because why the hell not. I really like these colors too. So this is the kit. It is called the Purple Bouquet Kit. It is sized for the horizontal and then I grabbed this washi tape from my stash. These four simply gilded rolls and then these ones right here. This one's the Planner Society and this one might be the Planner Society. I can't remember. This might just be a floor one I've picked up somewhere. I'm not sure which of these rolls I'm going to use, but they all seem to match these colors. So we're going to just get started and I probably should, before I pick what washi I'm going to use because I don't know what yet, I'm going to do what I did last week and stick these checklist boxes in this box here on the end. I'm still not sure what washi I'm going to run across the top, so I'm going to start running a skinnier washi down the middle here. And I'm going to use the purple, I think. And I think what I'm going to do is layer these two. So before I do anything else, I'm going to wipe out this with the white out. And I think I'm going to leave these flags since the color seems to be the right purple. And that kind of covers up the bottom. And then we'll stick some stickers on top of this. I'll grab a full box here. And then a couple of trackers. I'm going to be using this Pilot Fine Liner for the majority of the spread. But on top of the stickers, I'm going to be using a Pigma Micron. So Instagram, and I've decided to interpret it as either did I do a story or did I post? And then for comments, did I check and answer some YouTube comments? So now that that's done, I am going to go through and write in my blood, my, I'm going to still use this the same way. Two lines for blood, one line for weather, two lines for blood pressure, and then the last two lines for dinner. I'm going to enter in my dinner and my weather for the first four days of the week because that's what I usually have at the beginning of the week. Okay, so for Monday, my big things for the day is that my husband is actually off. So I want to use this little heart from the kit to note that. And then I have um, something going up for my patrons that day. So I'm going to use this little laptop sticker and this coffee mug to list the couple of things I want to do for work in the morning. And then the rest of the day, I'm going to take off and hang out with my husband. I think I'm going to use this gray Tombow Food Nasuki to do some brush pen work on this week. I'm not sure how I, if I like that or not, or if I would, should have just used a black. Maybe I should use a black pen and just go over that. It's a little sloppy, but I think I like that better. For Tuesday, I'm gonna be needing to get a lot of work done. So my two things that I've got going on though, my two timed things is that my kid has a Tuesday night rehearsal and I have a podcast interview. I cut this uh, K Glam Co podcast sticker so that it would be an icon. And then I just pulled one of my Tombow Twin Tone markers that matched MacGyver. I want to make sure I don't overbook myself on Tuesday. I just want to be able to sit and use that as a day where when I'm not interviewing, I'm spending my time creating 
videos and other such things, I'm going to take a half box and just fill up, well, half of the box so that I can't overdo it. Like that basically shows me that I only get so much time to actually do shit during the day. All right, use my, my, my black Tombow. And just to be a little decorative, I'm gonna use a little candle sticker from the kit and a washi tape roll. Because I like to burn a candle when I'm create, like sometimes when I'm getting creating stuff done because it's the smell sometimes helps me out. So this is just to remind me that Tuesday needs to be a day where I create shit. So Wednesday, um, I've got a workshop at 11 a.m. that I'm participating in. And then my downloads for my patrons go live. So I'm gonna mark the workshop with another computer munchkin and then this little like writing actually I'll use the munchkin for the downloads and this little writing thing for the workshop I'm gonna leave Wednesday mostly blank I've already booked up these two days with hanging out and creating I want to make sure that Wednesday I'm leaving open because as much as I like to make plans ahead of time I also have to recognize that that doesn't always happen and I need to make sure that there's room in my schedule for shit happening. And so I'm gonna take an event sticker and this laundry basket and just mark in, oh hi Mock, that I will be doing laundry that day. Thursday, I'm gonna use these two icons from the kit. This cell phone represents that I have a Facebook Live with my patrons and this little spray bottle represents that I need to clean my bathroom that day. Thursday, I know is going to be another day I'm going to need to film and edit. So I'm going to write that in and then leave the rest blank. So on Friday, I have a patron hangout at 6 p.m. I need to go grocery shopping. I forgot to put in on Thursday that I need to meal plan. Putting in the grocery store helped to remind me of that. So I'm going to use this event box and this meal plan sticker from Christian Designs with my lettering on it. I'm going to slap the weekend banner here. I'm use this marquee sticker to mark in my kids' football game on Saturday night. Then the only thing I'm gonna put on Saturday for sure is wash sheets for sure on this section. I wanna leave the rest of the weekend somewhat, the rest of Saturday somewhat open because Sunday is basically slammed. I'm gonna cover up half of Sunday. Sunday's gonna be so swamped that when we actually have downtime, I want to just be able to handle the downtime. But I'm gonna white over, white out over this grandparents day just because I've covered up half of it. I wanna make sure the rest of it's not showing. If it isn't obvious, I'm singing at church on Sunday. And I'm going to mark over here two other church related things. I have a quartet rehearsal at 10 a.m. and then at 12.30 a.m. I have a meeting for a program both my kids are gonna be doing. This is gonna seem remarkably immature, but the program my kids are gonna be doing has a comprehensive sexuality and sex ed course over the course of this year at my church, and I'm using an eggplant sticker to mark it. I'm just gonna do it. And I think that is everything I'm going to do for this week. I'm really liking how it's looking so far. I like using the brush pen. That's sort of interesting to me. What are the techniques that you use to force yourself to focus on one thing while not allowing yourself to schedule more shit? I'm blocking off a section of my day with half box stickers. Is there something you do in your planner or are there other things that you do to like lay claim to a day and say this day belongs to this thing and nothing else and nobody else gets to have a piece of it? How do you do that? Let me know in the comments down below. Thank you so much for watching. Subscribe if you haven't already and I will see you next time.